Jim Misfits here, warming up for our next arm day. We'll see you out there. <laughs> Let's get it. Uh. Take off. Guys, so we're doing 21s uh, with dumbbells. So you sit on it. Well, there's like several different variations you can do for 21s, but we're just doing a different one today. So we're just doing 21 reps. We're sitting on an incline bench. It's like like him. And so he's getting, with his arms back like this, he's getting a full pull on his bicep. So he's getting a full extension versus like maybe like getting to here or something like that. He's getting a full like all the way down, coming all the way back up. Like his pink headphones. They're pretty sexy, right? Oh, wow. <laughs> the manliness on this guy. <laughs> Alright, pointers. Hit me with them. What? Uh, pointers. Pointers? Yeah. I mean, when you're doing this on the incline bench, make sure your shoulder blades are down and back. Like, tight. But you're still wanting to get the point of getting sitting on the incline bench is to stretch out your bicep muscle. Think about it. Think about just stretching your bicep like this versus an incline like that all the way down. It stretches it more. Here. I got seven more. Yeah. Bang them out, bang them out. These are killer. These are literally killer. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go bro. Hey, his camera's gonna die. All right, so no rest for this. Hey. No rest, no rest. Chug, 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 chug. Oh. Chug it down, chug it down. Repping out, repping out. Yeah, let me talk to him real quick. Guys, we apologize. Today's gonna be a super quick day. We're just doing two bicep and two tricep for y'all. We have short battery life and short time to film tonight, so it's going to be really fast. So we apologize if there's not enough information or not whatever, but love you guys. It's okay, David. We still love you. Oh my god. My biceps are oh, dead. Alright, dude. What's next? What's next? Soul crushers. Alright, guys. What we're doing here is some uh, barbell skull crushers. But notice how his elbow, like when he's coming at the top, he's not going all the way to a resting like 90 degrees at your armpit. He's staying back a little bit to keep the tension on your tricep. So you're going down, tension on tricep still. Think about it, at the top you'd be resting. So we're just leaving it so we have no rest time. Areas. Time under tension is important. Killer exercise for your tries. See how instead of going like this, we have two more sets. I'm not going right here. I'm back here, guys. No rest. No rest for me. So he's about to show you a reverse grip curl bicep curl. So you see his hands, it's like on a W bar, his hands are over top, he's got his thumbs underneath, he's going full extension down, all the way up, all the way down. It's going to work out most of your forearms with a lot of tension right here and a lot of like the inside of your bicep outside, or sorry, outside your bicep right here. But yeah, it's pretty dope, feels good. Also notice how his wrists stayed straight. They didn't do this or this. They stayed yeah. straight. So he's going like this. It's a full motion like that. Yeah, you don't want to bend your wrist at all. Yeah. I'm glad he brought that point up. Bending your wrist is going to mess with it. I mean, because this is a forearm workout as well as it is a bicep workout. Look at that. Perfectly straight wrist. You'll feel the burn right here. Brachial radialis will be on fire. <laughs> Those last few reps, I just kind of felt like almost bringing it to my 
face and really slowly bringing it down. Oh, like this, like this, like yeah. this? Yeah, like that. Just Feels like great. that. Mm. And horrible at the same time. Mm. The slow <laughs> bicep. You know program. those good, bad feelings you get? Of course, of course. <laughs> of course. Everyone watching is like, no. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking Yo. about. Yo. <laughs> that's all we got on that one for y'all. Do you want? Oh. Hey. <laughs> Alright guys, uh... Oh, the, the kazoo kid? Kazoo? What? what are you, what are you Wait about? a minute! Wait a minute! Who are you? Alright guys, uh, what we're doing here is, uh, we're hitting some tricep pushdowns, but we're doing, uh, reverse grip. So we're getting a little bit wider on the W bar. You see this bar? It's called the W bar because it's a W. The W. And we're grabbing right here. It's actually an M bar. Then, Oh, oh snap, what damn, is it? I'm dumb. <laughs> <laughs> um, but anyways, uh, it kind of helps to get out a little bit further. We like to bend our hips, like get a little bit of a hip hinge. So instead of standing up straight and it stops you, it limits you, you hit right there. Instead, you can really get that nice contraction at the bottom. Yeah. See what I'm talking about, how we get the hip hinge? How you can get back a little bit further and really get that like tricep kickback type squeeze contraction in the back. Versus being standing up straight like this. But these are amazing guys. Ew, I don't smile what, like that. I'm serious, guys. Try these out. Okay, ever since I tried these, I switched these from regular uh, palms facing down push downs, and I like have never gone back. These just hit my triceps in a whole different way. They're they're sexy. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> When you're doing it, you really want to make sure you got your chest up in like a strong posterior chain. You know what I'm saying? Like strong back instead of just curling over and doing them out. Like be strong in every position you're doing. Like and subscribe. God, this is cheesy. We love you. Peace out. <laughs>